Hey guys, uh, welcome to this tutorial. Um, today I will explain how to create your first augmented reality application for Android using AR Foundation and AR Core. So the first step is to create a new project. It's important to choose the 3D template. So AR Foundation Android will be the project name and I will create it so um, we just need to wait a little bit for this to open and the first uh, two things that we will do is to add some packages two packages uh, mainly here in window package manager uh, let I will wait to till all the packages are loaded and um, I need to find AR foundation AR foundation and I will install the 3.0.1 version it is installed as we can see in the screen I need to uh, install the AR Core XR plugin also the 3.0.1 version and click on install after all the packages are loaded we need to add uh, two more things uh, so the first one is uh, at the AR session origin and AR session. Uh, in AR session origin, I will add uh, the image manager, AR tract image manager and I will we will create an, a library for the uh, images that we will use in our application we will use uh, image tracking so that when the camera uh, detects the image it will uh, display our object so we need to build a reference image library and I will add an image my project. You can use uh, any other image for your application. So I will drag it and I will specify the size to be uh, 1. Now uh, in AR session origin I need to drag this to serialized library. I will change the max number of moving images and also uh, we need to uh, create an object to display. I will create a cube and I will add the a material a red material to the cube now I will delete this and drag it the cube to the track image profile and the next step is to um, add a component uh, it's a script and for this uh, I will open the in the github of unity and I will uh, look for AR foundation samples you can search for it in google and I will click in assets and scenes and the one we are doing is image tracking so I, we need the track image info manager script so let's create a script with this name in here new script create and that 
Now let's open it and copy all of this. Now, uh, once we have uh, this script, we need to drag the camera, the your camera, and also we don't need the main camera, so I will delete it, and this will be our main camera. And the next step is okay. I think uh, with this we are done. We only need to change some uh, uh, package settings. First, we need to change from platform to Android. So I will click on switch platform and let's wait. Now, uh we will click player settings and change the default company name I will uh, write David and in other settings we need to check that we don't have the Vulkan API and to check then uh, the package name is correct also uh, change the API level to Android 8.0 and I think that's all. We need to have our device uh, connected to the computer so that we can um, try it on our mobile phone. So I will click on build and run. I will name it uh, AR Foundation and Android. Foundation Android. and now it's looking for the devices so let's wait just a little bit uh, some advantages that uh, AR Foundation and AR Core have are that we can use uh, color uh, images for the targets. Mm, this is something that uh, Buforia doesn't allow. They only allow a uh, gray scale. And also is that we can use this for free. Uh, while Buforia, if you want to use it on your applications, you need to pay for your license. And also that it's not uh, very complicated to um, to use so uh, now uh, that I'm talking I remember that and there is one little change that we need to make um, I will show it uh, right now so uh, now the unity uh, application has loaded. I will allow uh, all the permissions and I will open the uh, the target. <coughs> so uh, now the Unity uh, application has loaded. I will allow uh, all the permissions and I will open the uh, the target. <coughs> Now, as you can see, you, uh, here is the cube, but it is uh, really small and it's it looks really weird because we need to change uh, in the script some some things. For example, I will change uh, here at uh, the, this line. I will comment it because we don't want this to happen. Now I will uh, build and run again. So uh, I will wait uh, for this application to be loaded again. Let's just wait uh, for a um, second more. Uh, 
and now uh, it will it is installing it to the device let's just wait a little bit more to be installed now um, our application is updated and, and we can open the target again and as you can see here is the uh, red cube that we just created it uh, you can see I think it's better to print these images because it gives uh, more precision to to the smartphone so as you can see here is how we uh, create our first uh, augmented reality application using Google AR Core and AR Foundation.